What is accelerated self-healing? Accelerated self-healing is a process of identifying what you are already doing to heal yourself, not on a conscious level, but on an unconscious level and a subconscious level, energetic level. What Your body is always healing itself, and it can't heal everything that's wrong at one time. So it has priorities. Those priorities exist according to your lifestyle, your thoughts, your actions. When you take up an exercise program or change your diet, your body's energy patterns have to change to support that and go in the direction that you're intending to move. And so you'll have priorities based on your life right now of what your body is trying to heal, what it's trying to detoxify and repair and regenerate and, and cleanse and, and what it's trying to balance and harmonize. And so our theory is rather than trying to identify a pattern of dysfunction, which we call a, a disease, and put a name on that and try to somehow manage that, it's called in modern medicine, with uh, a toxin that blocks your body's pathways that produce that unwanted response, we don't focus on the unwanted response so much. We look at what is working and how it's working. Your body's communicating, it's trying to create certain responses, it's, and we can read where the stresses are. That, oh, it's, the liver is, is showing a stress response. Okay, so what balance is that? Or where is it coming from? Oh, the liver is responding to a stress from the colon. The colon is the head of the causal chain, the liver is the tail end of the causal chain. So what balances the stress response in the colon? Oh, it's this herb here. Okay, that makes sense. That's uh, an herb that's good for the colon. But there's lots of herbs that are good for the colon, the colon, but your colon right now is responding to this one. That's evidence-based healing. So we're, we're observing the evidence in biocommunication of what your body is responsive to right now to quiet the stress responses, to quiet the calls for help. You can think of it as cells in your body that, that are receiving a signal from the body saying, hey, or from their environment saying, hey, this is out of whack. We need to, this is important. We need to address that. Okay, I'm gonna work on that. If only I had this vitamin, then I could do that. Or if only I had this mineral, I could do that. If only I had access to this particular DNA that's turned off right now, if we could send this the information, the blueprint signal to turn that DNA back on, then I could make that response that I'm trying to do. If your cell is trying, if it's working hard, that's like an overactive, inflammatory type of response. If something's blocked and it's not able to, to produce a reaction, that's an underactive or degenerative type of response. And we also see responses where there's a blockage in, in the energy flow, the, the continuity of uh, ability for energy to continue to flow, which is a, a, a detoxification uh, type of blockage. And all those three types of imbalance responses that are measurable electronically on the acupuncture meridians and points will come to balance at the same level of harmonic energy of uh, all the systems being coherently working together on the same page. It's like having a football team where, you know, oh, the, the quarterback is uh, having lunch and, and you know, and the, the forwards are over there practicing and the other guys are trying to play the game here. But when the whole team is on the same field, on the same page, working together, that's when things get done.